Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can download and install Golang on your Windows 11 operating system. So let's get started and let's start with the installation of Go. So first of all, go to your favorite browser and search for download Go. And the first link which will appear here will be from go.dev. So just click on that link. Now this will redirect you to go.dev forward slash doc forward slash install page where you can see the procedure of how to install Golang on various different operating system. Now in case you land on the go.dev file which is the main home page you can click on this download button here and it's going to redirect you to this page which says go.dev forward slash dl so here also you can see featured downloads here we have microsoft windows apple mac os and linux systems and the featured download for windows is this msi file if you land on the go.dev forward slash doc forward slash install page you can once again see the download button here and also you can see the instructions. So when I click on the download button, you will be redirected to the same page. Now in here, as you can see, the featured download for Windows is this MSI file. If you scroll down here in this list, you will also find that MSI link here. So we are going to download this dot msi file so i'm going to click on this dot msi file link now once this msi file is downloaded you can go to this download icon and you can go to the folder where it's downloaded so i'm going to click on this msi file and let me minimize the browser and this folder explorer here and you can see the download of go programming language has been started here so now the process of installation of Go is very simple. You just need to click on next here and then accept license terms and conditions and click on next. And this will be the location where Go will be installed on your Windows operating system. So if you don't have the good reason to change this location, just leave it as default. If you want to change the location, click on change and then choose your desired folder. Once you have provided the destination folder where Go will be installed, click on next. And now you are ready to install Go. So at this point, you just need to click on this install button, which is going to show you this kind of warning, which says, do you want to allow this app to make changes on your device? What this warning means is Go is going to try to add the Golang executable file part to your system paths and it's asking for your permission. I'm going to click on yes here, which is going to start the installation process. And once you see this kind of message, which says completed the Go programming language setup wizard, that means Go is successfully installed on your Windows operating system. So at this point, you can click on finish. Now, in order to check whether Go is properly installed on your system, or not, what you can do is you can just click on the search bar and search for CMD, which is going to give you this result, which is for command prompt. So just click on the command prompt icon here, which is going to open the command prompt. Now here you just need to give a very small command, which is go version and then press enter. And if it returns the version of go, then Go is properly installed on your Windows 11 operating system. Now, how this uh, command prompt recognizes that Go is uh, in your system path. Now, to know that, you can just type the command path in your command prompt, and you will see at the end that this installer for Go have added this path for the Go binary file in your system path and that's how your command prompt recognizes that golang uh, is installed 
and it recognizes the go commands right so if this go version is visible then go is working on your windows 11 operating system